Hello, I'm Natalie Glasson from the Sacred School of Omna. And the weekly message that I wish to share with you today is from the Celestial White Beings and the Pallades. It's entitled Divine Inner Consciousness, channeled through myself, Natalie Glasson, on the 24th of March, 2016. It is with love we step forth to greet you. We are the energy and consciousness of the celestial white beings and the Pallades. We merge our energy in beautiful synthesis, creating a wondrous ensemble of light, which we shower over and through your being. Colors of white, blue, green, like jewels of light, cascade, distributing our combined energy, consciousness, and frequency to support the presence of the Creator's light within all. Our light has a greater purpose, which is to shed illusions connected to the concept of truth and the perspective of spiritual or creator truth in order to encourage many to engage with their divine inner consciousness. Even people moving in spiritual circles can hold on to concepts and ideas of spiritual or creator truth. However, when the knowledge is held within the mind, it is only a product of learning rather than experience or embodiment. The mind cannot fully understand the pure consciousness of the Creator through learning or lack of experience. However, it can often be learning which opens the mind. The mind can engage with the pure consciousness of the Creator. Often when the mind receives an idea, it can wish to hold on to the idea, neglecting the acceptance of other insights. When the mind and the pure love of the Creator work as one, then the mind is able to adopt the flowing, free nature of the soul and creator, being constantly, divinely inspired. Your divine inner consciousness is an active light within your being, which vibrates at the same frequency as the creator, and therefore holds the true and pure consciousness of the creator. Your divine inner consciousness simply exists within you. When you engage with it, the results are states of love, peace, harmony, knowingness, unity and acceptance. These sensations or states of consciousness abundantly fill every cell of your being, every chakra, every aspect of your auric field as well as your thoughts and feelings. The sensations can be likened to fireworks of luminous light and inspiration moving as a current through your being. Your divine inner consciousness, which emanates the purest truth frequency of the Creator, could also be labeled your soul's wisdom, your spirit or even your higher self. However, we are speaking of states of high vibrational, pure consciousness, born from your connection with the Creator. These states of consciousness move beyond 
your thoughts, feelings, perspectives and opinions, causing all of their previous programming to fall away. This divine inner consciousness is free from judgment, fear or illusion. It is a consciousness of love which when connected with creates a new state of consciousness within your being. The consciousness of love has the power to gradually, if continued to be connected with, erase all previous thought patterns of negativity, fear or illusion. So powerful is your divine inner consciousness or pure consciousness state of love that it is immensely healing for your body, being and reality. All that is required is your willingness to accept your divine inner consciousness, allowing it to intensify and move throughout your being as you accept, observe and experience. There are aspects of your current state of being and consciousness which hinder or block you from accessing and experiencing your divine inner consciousness. Such behaviors as judging yourself or others, being inflexible in observing the opinions of others, Doubting yourself or others, lack of trust or faith in self, others and the Creator, fear in change or fear in nurturing experiences, lack of self-love or lack of love for others, ingratitude, stubbornness, trying to control self, others, situations or the Creator. We could continue with our explanation, however we know you have grasped our meaning. Any process that encourages you to believe in separation leads you away from your divine inner consciousness. Many upon the earth hold spiritual knowledge Maybe they believe in spiritual or healing techniques, philosophy, religion, or way of life or thinking. If the individual is only open to their spiritual knowledge and is unable to view, understand, accept, or even simply allow, free from judgment, then this can be a block to accessing their divine inner consciousness. Judgment, the creation of fear or intolerance, even within spiritual concepts, ideas or experiences, cause a diversion of the mind to separation rather than union. When there is a belief in union, then the divine inner consciousness can easily be accessed. Belief in union can manifest through your compassion for self and others, love for self and others, acceptance of self and others, broad-mindedness towards self and others. In truth, a loving open-mindedness gifted to self and all will create peace within your being, which will usher you forth to connect with, observe and experience your divine inner consciousness. Every time you create a thought, feeling or action born from and focused upon unity, then you allow yourself to accept your divine inner consciousness. We can recognize that behaviors such as judgment, which we feel is the most harmful, cause a block in connecting with your divine inner consciousness. 
However, we recognize that judgment is a part of a person's journey towards spiritual awakening. Judgment comes from the belief of separation within an individual. Separation is a feeling and experience of pain. An individual engaging in judgment has yet to fully accept themselves as a being of love, as well as not realizing or being able to view the beauty of the Creator in all. This includes the expressions all create. Any judgment is born from pain of separation within your being, especially when you are attached to the judgment you are making about yourself or another. Being attached to, an adju- to a judgment is enjoying sharing the judgment, feeling that the judgment proves your importance or knowledge, as well as feeling that the judgment must be delivered. It can be challenging to dissolve the mind's pattern of judging self or others, even judging whether certain situations are good or bad. However, judgment can be dissolved when you let go of your attachment to judgment. When a judgment arises within, first you can acknowledge it, then let it go by breathing it away. Continue this, if needs be, until your attachment to the judgment has dissolved. Then contemplate. Does the judgment hold truth within it, and does it serve you, others, or the situation? If the judgment is of service, you will be able to deliver it from love and compassion. It will actually transform from a judgment into an observation. If the judgment does not serve you, it will be easier to discard it with love. Judgment comes from a need to feel important within. When you love yourself unconditionally, the need to feel important dissolves because you are fully nurtured. This changes your perspective of yourself and others while allowing you to engage with your divine inner consciousness. Please recognize that we are not judging you by bringing this to your attention. We simply wish to aid your recognition of that which blocks you from accepting and engaging with your divine inner consciousness. We also wish for you to realize that judgment will arise and there is no need for you to judge your judgments with further harmful or critical thoughts. Loving yourself while recognizing the judgments you create will allow you to detach from the patterns of judgment within your being. It also doesn't mean that you cannot express yourself in the way you wish to, to support yourself and others. However, it is to encourage all expressions to flow from a space of pure consciousness within you. To engage with your pure inner consciousness. Encourage yourself to enter into states of peace and relaxation through deep breathing, meditation and focus upon loving yourself. Recognize that your divine inner consciousness is a consciousness of pure love from the Creator. When you engage with this part of your being, you are communicating and expressing the Creator. Affirm I engage with 
and embody my divine inner consciousness. I engage with and embody my divine inner consciousness. I engage with and embody my divine inner consciousness. Call upon our combined energy and light of the celestial white beings and the Pleiades. Feel our white, blue and green light surrounding you as you breathe into your being. We are magnifying your sensitivity to your divine inner consciousness. Imagine, sense or acknowledge a source of pure consciousness within your being. Discover where this source of pure consciousness is and what it feels like. Imagine that you sink into the pure consciousness and it fills your entire being, illuminating you and moving you into a new state of consciousness. The more you experience and practice this, the more you will recognize the strength and power of your pure consciousness, feeling it penetrating your being. It will offer to you states of peace, fulfillment, renewal and healing. Through your repetition and acknowledgement, you will discover the abundance of your divine inner consciousness, flowing freely throughout your being, and the knowingness it promotes within your being, mind and feelings. We are divinely in love with you. The celestial white beings and the Pleiades. <laughs>